lame SSMDI. <laughs> this is Rake and Grass's lame secret spot marking ducky item. One of a kind in the universe of the low budget lazy graphic artist game development. <laughs> Don't ask, just sell it to get some extra cash. P.S. No, there is no secret mega bonus if you collect all of them throughout the game. P.P.S. I'm not testing you. I mean it. No mega bonus. Really, my last word. Just sell it. These can be hacked open for money. Ooh. Do you have to, like, pay money to hack them? You need to buy the hacking tool. Alright. Manual crack. How do you do these? Uh, you know the game where you're like, well, you'll, you'll find out shortly. Uh... Okay, so it has a 2, a 4, a 5, and a 6. Uh, 6... It was 6245. Interesting. You got some magic cards. Yeah. I think you mean nasty robots. <laughs> Robot type pervert. <laughs> this is a this is a pack of cards called Nasty Robots used in the Jets and Guns the Torturing card game. Type pervert. <laughs> First card in the pack seems to be Hammertron who allows the player to nail the left hand of an opponent every round until oh, the robot is destroyed. Fucking god. He's a nasty man. He is a nasty man. A dirty nasty boy. <laughs> That's a one of a kind collector's item. You gotta sell that shit. Yeah. Get me some money for that. And let's, let's try this one. What's in here? So the green one means you got it in the correct place, as well as it's the correct number? Yes. And there's only ever one of any given number, so this is really easy. So it's like either like 1, 5, 2, 3, or 2, 5, 1, 3? 1, 3. Yeah. I got Hero's Guide, so it's a hand. Secret weapon, the Punisher, is hidden in the a flying latrine in Klaxon's research complex. Oh, I see. Guess I might as well keep that. Might as well keep it until you find that thing. Yeah. Well, in the meantime, I kind of want to buy the hero's license. Well, you can afford it. Like that. That's probably fine. Alright. And now you can see I'm decorated. Got it. Oh, you got some stuff on your one. Yeah. And Bronze Explorer one. Schrodinger's Donut. Fine, fine meal in the end of the singularity. Yeah. See, the price is negative 50,000. That's because it can clear all my upgrades. That's how much it would be. Oh, this is the other available ship at this point, by the way. It's a Wanderworth, big fucking W1. hot dog truck. Disgusting space van is often used by fast food delivery boys, but it has some advantages for outer space combat too. Big plus is the massive refrigerator helping to significantly improve heat sinking. That's, I don't think that's how that works. Don't worry about it. <laughs> the van is one big credence. Thus, it has more room for weapons than G3 Goblins, but it's a pretty cumbersome flyer. I see. So yeah. Alright. Let's see what the next level has in store. Have you ever been- Have you ever been hired by a sheriff looking like a chimp? Well, I have. Howdy, gunman. We could use your skill and hardware if you want to make a fair profit. I'm Sheriff Livingstone of the police department of this sector. We're short of men, and we need to wipe out smugglers on a couple of small planets and asteroids around here. 
We're hiring capable men like you. Each one will lead a strike on one of the criminal's bases. The profit from wrecked ships and confiscated cargo is yours. What do you say? It's hard I, to say no to a chimp in a top hat. I say I somewhat regret not having bought any bombs. <laughs> well, we'll see how it goes. You've got little tiny plasma balls, so I'm sure it'll be fine. From behind! That's dirty! They're on fire. I already don't remember what the mission was. Wipe out the smugglers! Wipe out the smugglers? Yeah. I'm not used to listening to this song without any lyrics. Yeah. Alternatively, there are lyrics for this song? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, what? What are you talking about? Jets and Guns made lyric versions of their songs? I mean, the band that did the soundtrack. Is this the, um... Is this, yeah. is this the mission where you go crash the concert, or is that a different mission? No, the, the soundtrack will make that very obvious. Oh, so it starts right from the beginning? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Do you get extra points, or like money, from mowing down all the people? Uh, I get a bonus if I kill a large amount at the same time. Is that good for the ratings? Yeah, it's good for the ratings. That's definitely oh, good. Oh, that was not where I wanted to stand. It's definitely gonna be good for the ratings. Like, that's why... That's why Space Ron Burgundy <laughs> one serious shit to... We could use the ratings. They'll be crispy and stuff. <laughs> Once you're, like army to just burn in the lava. My hull is not doing super hot. But you're too fat to die! How can that be? Well, I've been hitting things. Oh, you found a secret. Yeah, I need to not... There we go. Not fly into the laser? Yeah. What? Damn, that thing doesn't want to die. Yeah, it can handle some... Is that a... Is that just a big-ass revolver? <laughs> it's just a big flying gun. I mean... You did have the option of purchasing a flying hot dog van. I sure did. So. Oh, I got a space pirate. I saw that little green, uh, that little green circle around that ship. No, I was too busy looking at the, like, giant green ship and all the floating planets in the background. That's another gun. Yeah, it is. A lot of these ships just look like, like, old-fashioned bombs with propellers on the back. Like, I guess a... Like a... That kind of, the kind of bomb I'm thinking of has, like, some fins on the back or something. But instead of fins, these ships just have a propeller. Do you have to press... It's button? allowing me to manage heat. You can see my hull integrity and heat on the bottom left. And by just tapping the button, I can... Oh, I just rammed into a wall. <laughs> oh no, your hull integrity! 
It's critical! Yeah, I am super fucked. But you got that cargo. I did get that cargo. Oh, bust that cage open! Yeah! Oh, there he goes! He that is looks, angry. That looks like someone's spore creation. Yeah. He had a... He, he was having a... Having a squish. I'm really happy that that thing is, like, invulnerable once you set it loose. Yeah. It would be so sad if you set it loose only for it to just blow the fuck up. You, uh... I died. You died. Uh, Fish and mail! Fish and mail. I'm gonna get some bombs. You were the hero! You're supposed to be the chosen one! Yeah, well... Like I said, this game isn't actually ridiculously easy, like one might hope. Sell that thing. Getting some bombs would be significantly more useful. God, what do I even... What do I even sell in order to make up that difference? I guess I could sell the cooling system? Apocalyptic! Favorite choice of Chuck Boris. Boris. Chuck Boris. Boris is here. Alright, see you next time, where I will hopefully not die. Later.